Hi everyone, I'm Mary Bao. So today we're gonna to talk about VRChat Word Tutorial 6 Git about the post processing or how to set up post processing on Unity. So you already know that VRChat use a new Unity. So you see here, you can install it if you want to. It's the Unity 2019.4. That 29 f1 so you have the installer if you want to install on quest don't forget to install android target support we're gonna also use uh, the shadow asset vrc word post processing ui so shadow create that video to show how it's work but this person didn't tell you how to do it and how to install it properly I will tell you how to do that. First of all, this is Unity, the new Unity we use for the video. Go to Window, Package Manager, and then we search Bus Processing, Install, and it takes some time. Okay, so it's already done. We already installed it properly. Now we need to install the Shatu Unity package and import it in our project. Let's test it. Press on demo and then you see the color change it. Now it's a bit darker the floor. So we can uh, do something to white color. There we go. Now you see Unity is a bit smooth right now. I mean, when you move, it's like smooth when you do the camera. Now you see the color change on the cube, but it doesn't change on the camera. So if example, I use a reference camera coming close to the area, you see the camera preview doesn't show the same color. You need to be careful because this is what you see in the game and not this. Go to your VR chat word that you create your VR scene descriptor. Now you see reference camera none. You need to add the reference camera here. So let's grab the reference camera and put it here and then let's test it all right so now you see the color change and now we see the cube blooming which is awesome so you can press on vignette you see a bit darker like in oral game depth of field you become blind motion blur when you move you see motion blur when you move or rotate it chromatic sleep so the sleep mode so you can put dark and light contrast if you want to put more brighter and blooming the square is stop it blooming so if you want to put it back there we go the square is look like blooming so this is how you can create neon light so I hope this video is very helpful and I really thanks for all that chat to create for this unity package i hope this video is very helpful bye bye